Welcome back to the Ripple Effect server. So I have been learning the craft of making these uh, authentic Swedish chairs behind me. I can even do it by heart now. Like this, you have six like this. You get a stair and uh, like this, you have the, the signs. And then just, uh, you know, put one maybe here. So nice. So now I'm in the mood of uh, making some more. This looks like a nice area for them. Ah, <sighs> that's better. Now Bank can finally invite uh, guests over. This is also a wonderful area, but something is missing, don't you think? Yeah, something like this really spruces up the place. Dutch will be so happy I learned this craft. So enough with the good deeds of today. Let's get down to business. We have Freddy's order here. Outro theme song at my embassy. Uh, and I just asked him on Discord if it was okay to make one of these, you know, simple doorbell melodies. This kind of resembles a doorbell and that is what I kind of have in mind for those who order doorbells. But his outro song, I've made that once before, and then I did, you know, the whole tune and had bass and drums and uh, the whole kit, you know. But he says, yeah, it's okay with the simple version. So maybe let's first see how things look under here. All right, do we have some space to work with? Okay. Mm. Okay, I'm going to prepare here, maybe go get some uh, materials as well. I'm at the gold farm now, and there are some ingots and nuggets here. I don't know, am I a big jerk if I just take these? I've made a sketch of the doorbell arrangement and I will need 40 note blocks, um, 24 packed ice blocks and 16 gold blocks. So let's see, this will give me 13. I think I'll do it. 17. One to spare. Maybe we can just help a little, turning these uh, nuggets into ingots, at least. Hmm, we're kind of out of wood. Maybe we can convert these as well, uh, before we buy any more from, from duds. Let's see. This is 10 more. Great, okay, so we have enough note blocks for this project and then some to spare. We also need a cobblestone for pistons. That's good. Uh, maybe some more regular stone for repeaters and uh, comparators. Yeah, let's do some mining actually. Maybe we can find some shiny blue rocks as well. No diamonds for decoy this time. But I think I have everything now for the doorbell project. What we need to do now is to break in here somewhere and make a platform. Oh, hello. This is pretty cool, actually. 
it's like an underground world here. Uh, that looks like Jimbo's uh, ground drop shop. There it is. Okay, can we get up here? Perfect. So maybe eight blocks down from ground level. I will do the wiring in the same manner I did at my embassy. That's the only way I can come up with to lead the wiring downwards without it uh, showing. So if we put piston there, redstone block, and the same on this. Hip. Can we push the button from here? Yes. We have sound. So usually when I make note block songs uh, in a game like this, I press the note blocks and compare uh, the frequency to a little keyboard I have beside my computer. But there is a technical way that I will try this time. If you look at the right hand side of the screen you can see it says uh, which instrument it is and the number of the note so if I right click this one more time it says 9 so you can compare it to this uh, chart and maybe this is uh, a faster way so I will get going with that and while I do that you can watch when I visited the Christmas area one last time. So now that uh, Christmas is f uh -oh, finally over, <laughs> no, officially over, I think it's safe to, to go to the place that would uh, destroy Christmas. Uh, where is that? This way, I think at uh, a live stream. Let's take a bite of Marlowe's the magic uh, pumpkin pies. At a uh, ripple effect live stream, people were chosen to have been naughty or nice uh, this year, or this last year. Am I going the right way here? Oh, this doesn't sound promising. I think we're sh supposed to go down here, but... Okay. Well, let's do that then. I would like to bring a bow, actually. There, we have a bow. I want to bring at least a bow and some blocks. So I was chosen to have been naughty this uh, year, which does not in any way represent real life. Oh, hello there, Max. And <laughs> here's the Grinch. And I think we were supposed to go to this house if we were naughty. Oops. Oh, here I am. That's me. Naughty. Okay, maybe let's take uh, take our head uh, later then. So apparently there is a way to destroy Christmas or something like that in here. So I thought maybe now that Christmas is over, we can go down here. It's uh, It's okay if it gets wrecked. And uh, these are small. This is a small maze. I don't like mazes. Um, and there is also parkour track, I think. I don't like those either. But both of these are are small. So 
uh, it's more to my taste. Okay, so these are stone pressure plates. Hmm. Okay, my plan will fail. Because you see the maze is changing. I think you can make it now. And my plan was to, you know, throw something here and activate the plate, but because that is stone, that won't work. My ad other plan was to shoot... Oh, I didn't bring arrows anyway. <laughs> but I don't think that will work either then, if it's a stone plate. Hmm. And I think this is impossible without it. So I think we will do what Orbni did. We have already established that I am naughty. So why not continue that tradition? Here we can see the art of Orbni. <sighs> okay. I have a feeling we need to, to cheat here as well. But let's at least give this a try. Mm. Woohoo! Okay. I saw this in uh, Wobnis video. I think it's the same here. You can't make this without also standing on the pressure plate at the same time. Which means you need to be two people. Or if you manage to trick uh, another mob to stand here. Huh, you can maybe make a snow golem here. <laughs> or is it enough time? Tell you what, let us try one time, just one time. Or maybe two. Okay. Uh, maybe it isn't po impossible. Okay, Obni, you called it. I'm going to cheat. But I fought bravely. <laughs> Can I reach that one? <laughs> ah, I will leave evidence behind. Okay, so this is terrifying. <laughs> this man doesn't look happy. Uh, I'm so tempted to stand on this plate. What will happen? Or maybe it, this is something to do to help someone else. Oh, of course. If you are two people here, the first will stand on this plate, the other one will jump over and stand on this plate. So the other can, can uh, come as well. So this shouldn't do anything here. What? <laughs> oh, that's just me. Oh, is that what happened? You were pushed as well? That's really me in Orbni. Okay, let's go down the stairs. <laughs> There's a chest here. Oh, Okay. Um. Up this room. Hmm. I know there are goodies behind this uh, 
these blocks. What do we do? Should we just stand on the plate? It did something. Okay, if hmm. <laughs> okay, this button then. Okay, now it's back to the way they were lit before. Okay, first that one, then this one, and then the plate. Let's see if we go down here, what happens? Oh, it was shooting. Can we pick these up? Great. So, because there are no arrows in here, what you need a bow for without arrows, right? Take this. <laughs> Let's hit him between the eyes. <laughs> I don't feel I have done a really good job here. Okay, we haven't tried push that button, then this, and then the plate. It is shooting, but only f oh yeah, from from this uh, <laughs> this uh, gun here, <laughs> and this is kind of pinching together in a threatening way. It looks kind of cute though. Once again, I will do what Orbni did. He just showed us in a video, right? How to do this. I hope it's not a trap behind here. I don't feel right taking anything here. Let's maybe just have a look. They are empty. So, let's put these back. You know, if you watch this video and you play on the server, you can give this a go. I haven't showed you anything, just how to fail. <laughs> and I mean, we could take our head here, but now I feel I don't really deserve it. Yeah, that was a bit of a failure, but uh, fun nonetheless. So I've made the first half of the second voice uh, it sounds like this now. Nice. So let's add the melody. This melody is gold. Uh -huh. <laughs> and it's so much easier with this uh, screen uh, because if uh, something goes wrong somewhere you can just look at the blocks and see which note it is you don't have to you know click them to try them out really helpful I think that's new in uh, 1.13 okay it's finished it didn't take long it sounds like uh, this now And uh, I got it really compact here, uh, because this repeater just powers these two, so the line back can go just beside it. And I also put down one of these cooldown mechanisms here, a pulse extender. So, uh, let's see, if you for instance spam click these, 
it just goes off uh, once. It won't trigger again until, you know, after the cooldown. Okay, so let's uh, order Stella this place. Um, I guess it's uh, three stairs. Hmm. Forgive me, Freddy, if I remember this wrong. Maybe it's all cobble. Too much cobble? Maybe. Uh, bricks there here. Huh? So we will see what kind of service we will request from Freddy in return. I have a couple of ideas, but um, thank you for watching this episode and I'll see you next time.